Hello guys, how are you today? Good to see you one more time. I hope you are okay out there. So today we're gonna continue with the third part about giving directions. So in this time, okay, I'm gonna give you different examples, real example, how you can give directions, okay, from the place that you work. So let's get started. So here we have the different scenarios, okay, that I brought you. Uh, it's about, okay, number one, how can I get to the nearest part? Number two, how can I get to the nearest restaurant? Three, how can I get to the nearest fish? And number four, how can I get to the nearest hospital? So the first four, okay, I'm gonna give it to you. I'm gonna give you some clues how to give direction, okay, for these four places. And the ones that are in black color are the ones that you need to do it, all right? So for practice. So like it says right here, the note, it says you have to give directions from the place you work. So I work in a school. So all the directions I'm gonna give you, uh, all the examples I'm gonna give you right now, I'm gonna be from the place of work, which is a school, all right? From the place I work to, all right? The, the place that I need to get to. So let's get started with the first one. So the, first, the question is, okay, excuse me, how can I get to the nearest park? So remember, okay, I'm gonna give you directions from the place I work, okay, which is the school. So this is the first one. Oh, get out of the school, okay? So I'm gonna correct this one because it says, oh, all right, it says, get out of school. Perfect. I wanna expand it again, okay, put it bigger for you. All right, here we go. One more time, okay? Oh, sorry, how can I? Now it's better. Okay, question, okay? How can I get to the nearest park? So I'm gonna give you directions from the place I work. So here we go. Oh, get out of the school. Then turn left from walking on street and go straight for five blocks. Finally, the park is in front of Capital Bank. So that's the way that you can get, okay, to the nearest park from the place I work. All right, which is the scenario I'm okay role playing for you. Second scenario is this one. The main question is, how can I get to the nearest restaurant? The same, okay? So remember, I'm giving you reductions, okay, from the place of work. And here we go. One more time. Excuse me, how can I get to the nearest restaurant? Oh, get out of the school. Then turn right on 3rd West Street. Okay, we're gonna correct this. 3rd, okay, it's missing the letter H. All right, now it's better. Okay, one more time. Excuse me, how can I get to the nearest restaurant? Oh, get out of the school. Then turn right on 3rd West Street. Later, go straight three blocks. And on the next corner, turn left. So the restaurant is between the drugstore and the laundromat. So that's the way I can give you directions, okay, from the place of work, how to get to the nearest restaurant. Next scenario. This one is about how to get to the nearest beach. And the question is, how, excuse me, how can I get to the nearest beach? So it says, oh, get out of the school, then go to the bus stop and take one or, one or two bus. So you can, you can say 102 or you can say 102. Doesn't matter, okay? You can say in, in both ways. So in this case, it's okay. You can take one or two bus. So you will travel for 25 minutes, okay? I'm gonna correct it right here, minutes. Okay, here is better like this. I'm gonna appear bigger, so one more time. Oh, get out of the school, then go to the bus stop and take one or two bus. So you will travel for 25 minutes and you will go past many small towns like Ayahualo, Zaragoza, and Corinto. Finally, after 25 minutes traveling, get off the bus in El Faro Mall, and you will walk straight for three more minutes and you will see the beach in front of you. So that's the way I can give you directions, okay? How to get to the nearest beach from the place I work, which is a school. Next one. Next, next scenario is about how to get to the nearest hospital. And the main question is that one, okay, as usual. How can I, excuse me, how can I get to the nearest hospital? So I'm gonna give you directions. Oh, get out of the school, they go down 7 North Avenue, later turn left and go straight for four blocks. And on the next corner, turn right and go straight for two more blocks. Finally, you will see the hospital on the right. 
So guys, so this is a way I can give you different directions, okay, to get to different places, okay, from the place you work. And that's the way that you need to do it. So now, okay, is your turn to give directions, how to get to the nearest bank, how to get to the nearest gas station, and how to get to the nearest police station. So that's the way, okay, that you need to do it following this for example, that I just gave you right here. So guys, so this is the way that I can teach you how to, how to give directions, how to get to different places, okay? Real, okay, in scenarios, okay, from the place that you work, which is, okay, in this case, for me, it's a school, okay? I don't know if you is gonna be from a bank, it's gonna be from a library, it's gonna be from a supermarket, I don't know. So follow my examples, watch my two previous videos, okay? How to use very well the um, directions, expressions. That's really important to use those expressions very well because it's not the same to speaking any language, it's totally different, okay, to English. All right, guys, excellent job. So this is the way that we do it. Thanks for being here with me. All right, learning English in this case, giving directions. So I see you later. Catch you later. <laughs>